reporting from New Hampshire. Vaughn's up next in Richmond, Virginia on Open Phones. Line for Democrats, good morning. Vaughn, you with us? Oh, yeah, hi. Go ahead. Yes, um, I just think that um, this whole immigration thing is nuts because America is based on immigration and um, every culture that comes here is a benefit and keeping Muslims out you know, is ridiculous. And Muslims are so valuable as humans and contributors to the world. You know, the extremists are totally different. The radical extremists have nothing to do with Islam and that people should actually read the Quran because the Quran is just another valid religion, whereas the extremists are just like extreme Christians or extreme anything. They're just insane extremists. They really have nothing to do with Islam or anything like that, you know. As we and talk- Go ahead, Vaughn. Didn't mean to cut you off. Coming to the country is ridiculous. The president spending uh, a bit of time this morning tweeting about his uh, efforts to push his travel ban. Uh, he wrote uh, just before 7 o'clock this morning, people, the lawyers and courts can call it whatever they want, but I'm calling it what it needs, uh, what we need and what it is, a travel ban. The Justice Department should have stayed with the original travel ban, not the watered down politically correct version they submitted to the Supreme Court. The Justice Department should ask for an expedited hearing of the watered down travel ban before the Supreme Court and seek much tougher version. Tweeting again uh, just before 7 o'clock, in any event, we are extreme vetting people coming in into the United States in order to help keep our country safe. The courts are slow and political. And just a few minutes ago, the president with uh, another tweet this morning, tweeting at uh, Fox and Friends this morning, saying Democrats are taking forever to approve my people, including ambassadors. They are nothing but obstructionists. Want approvals is what the president wrote. So uh, that's what's on the president's mind this morning.